great new courtroom drama. It's called All Rise. Good to see you. Thank you. Great to be back. Okay. Taylor Swift. Scott said it. She could be your daughter. Y'all yes, look so much I, alike. Thank you. I take that as a great compliment. Other yeah. people have said that too. Yeah, she was 16, I think, when she did the show. And um, I was sitting, when she, I didn't have any scenes with her, unfortunately, she, although she was great on it. I was sitting in the makeup trailer and she came in with her mom. And um, I went to turn to her to introduce myself to her. And she went, <gasps> <laughs> Because she had been such a fan. Of she geeked out. She geeked, she geeked out. I mean, I'll never forget that moment as long as I live. And she couldn't have been, she was just so generous with the crew members and their kids and signing, taking pictures. And and she was a star, but not like, you know, yep. a mega star. The just mega mentor she is. The mega mentor today. that she is now. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> and Justin Bieber. I mean, so many yeah, cameras on was, this show. Uh, he was, I think, 14. He was a, a real Look baby. Look at little Bieber on CSI. Is this unbelievable? <laughs> this was pre tats. Oh, that's when he had Ellen's haircut. <laughs> you remember that? Like that yes, was like, like when he first came out. Yes. What was it like when Beaver was on the set? That it was day? a little different than when Taylor Swift was around. Um, I didn't really have much interaction with him either. He, although he's like very sweet to me, I think he was a little bit of a challenge for uh, some of the crew members. But, uh, <laughs> but that's you know. It's I don't, so fun to look back and see them, right? It, it I know. Is. Everybody it wants is. to be on this show. Oh yeah. And also, that's not surprising. I, yes, it's a John Mayer was on our show. Oh, that's and, right. Wait, what was yeah. Mayer's role? I'm trying to remember. He didn't actually have a role. His band was performing at a bar that, you know, uh, it was a bar in which my character gets roofied. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the first thing he said to me. Oh, you're the one that gets roofied in my, during my song. Oh, <laughs> I snap. Said, yeah, yeah, it's true. Our fr control room right now it's is freaking, freaking out. out. <laughs> They're the biggest. Jen Dixon, relax in there. She She's loves like, John Mayer. What John Mayer? She's pulling it right oh, now. Yeah, he was right definitely now. hot. For sure. I mean, he still is, but and so talented. Um, your new show, we talked about it when you were on for your last movie here, yes, Dog's yes. Purpose. How is it playing the a judge? How is it putting yeah, on the, uh, you call it the robe? The, yeah. the, the, yes, the black robe. The black yes. robe. So to adjudicate. Yes. I'm a supervising yes, judge, so a lot of times I'm yeah, wearing, sure. you know, Suits yeah. and so on, but and Simone is the the judge that I have brought. She was a prosecutor that I championed to become the next judge. Yeah, she's all over the billboards and, and everything. Exactly, yeah. yeah, and she's fantastic in this part. I mean, just fantastic, just so much like strength and you know smarts and warmth and. You know, she, she's great. Mm -hmm. I, I'm like a Simone Music uh, fan club <laughs> member, like the <laughs> president of it. Um, and yeah, it's, it's been really, the, I love the writing, I love the cast. Um, occasionally I do adjudicate, uh, which is also fun because you get a bang. I want to adjudicate, yeah. right? No one listens to me in my household. I just want to adjudicate I something. I gotta say, and, there's like, the, and you you're sit above everybody, yeah. Oh, yeah. right? Exactly. And you, you do feel a, adjudicate. You do feel a sense of power. Uh -huh. and, um, and yeah. A lot to be said for that gavel. So get one. Get one. Get I'm one on for it. that household. Well, you talk about the gavel. I was looking through some of your Instagram and I saw some photos of this wedding. Oh, your son's wedding. Oh, yes. So my son, beautiful. my son Hugh, got married two years ago in Japan. He, he had taught English in Japan and fell in love with a Japanese uh, woman, young woman, gorgeous. named Miki. And um, so they got married in a, a it was to Tokyo Daijinku Shinto Shrine. Oh, wow. And, uh, so it was her parents. And so you guys did like the tra traditional. Yeah, I wanted to. Yes, and that, there's a lot of there's a lot that goes into wearing a traditional kimono. It's, I mean, it's a lot beautiful. of like, a lot of wraps and a lot of bound, binding because it's supposed to be kind of an androgynous look, you know. Okay. Um, oh yeah, I guess. <laughs> we so, love. I did share all of the photos. So you have to like have some help. Yeah, there's look at I have two assistants, uh, like the whole like getting into help that. me get, get into that thing. It was it was such a beautiful day. And you know we couldn't take photographs, uh, we couldn't take any videos or photographs when the ceremony was being done. So I remember thinking, I've got to be present. I have to really yeah, be remember present to, to remember this and take this in and and not get too emotional, because you know when you get emotional you you're spending too much time just keeping in, in your tears in check and stuff. And it was so beautiful, just amazing. I One love it. One of the most it. beautiful days I've ever had in my life. And he's an attorney, Hugh. He, well, he's uh, he's in law school right now at Georgetown. I will jump um, on up. I will be like, he is a head judge. So he's a judge. He's a Supreme Court <laughs> he's a Supreme justice. Supreme Court justice, Got and it. that's what we love. This it's is great. So good to see you. Oh, thank you. Come on, man. We're so excited oh, about this. Thank you. I'm, yeah, you thrilled. Can... We got to pick up back nine. So. Boom, baby. Yeah. That's what it's all about. You can catch it all. All right now on CBS.